Qatar is a country that is both modern and old at the same time. It's a country whose economy has been booming in the past few years, and currently it become one of the fastest growing countries in the world. But because of that fast growing, local and residents in Qatar assume that they cannot reduce their living costs. I did ask many of my friends and relatives about their spending money on food per day if they are going to eat all day outside the home. The average cost was at least 100 riyal, which is equal to 27 dollar. That cost is for their food needs, including breakfast, lunch, and dinner. So, in this blog, I'm going to show that we can actually reduce our cost. In the morning, I set a goal to spend only 20 reals. So, at first, without any dots, I choose to eat chapati, which cost only 1 real, and to drink karak, which also cost 1 real. They are a kind of a popular breakfast option in Qatar. After having my breakfast, I went directly to my office, but after a long day at my office, I needed a delicious and full full lunch, so I stopped next to a restaurant near to my home and ordered one shawarma sandwich with only 6 real, and I took one orange juice from a supermarket with 1 real. The lunch was perfect, but I needed a coffee so badly, so I decided to stop at McDonald's and got my Americano with a free donut too with only 5 reals. At the night, I wasn't really hungry, but I wanted to complete this vlog, so I picked a bakery next to my home and ordered one zato buy with 2 reals. So, at the end of the day, I only spent 16 reals on my food needs, but I also needed to drink water during the day, so I bought two bottles of water previously. So eventually, I found out that it's not that hard to get food needs per day at low cost. The only issue is that we don't have a variety of choices to keep living in that way.